Hello, yes, hello to all viewers. I will get this out of the way quick and say hello again to all the Michelle haters, and hello to everyone who is unsubscribing from this channel because I'm posting about Michelle's new book. Anyway, I checked out her last one, Becoming. It was a memoir that my, my grandmother actually recommended to me. That book painted a stunning portrait, and I was surprised to find out she has another one coming on the way. Why write another one, Michelle? Was a memoir not enough? People write memoirs, and it'd be the most random thing they would follow it up with. But she has hers, and hers is this. What is this, you might be wondering? This is called The Light We Care. This book has not come out yet, so in this video I'm going to discuss what we know about this book, the title, what we can expect from it, why she would write it, and when is it coming out, Sam? I need to know. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sam and I want to make self-growth normal. Because people shouldn't have to look this information up. It should just be mainstream knowledge. If you agree, then please make sure to smash that like button. Let's start with the title, shall we? Okay, so there's a light right? And it's being carried. Obviously, it's being carried by us. I don't know where people come up with these names, but it has to mean something, right? And she doesn't study lights or carrying for a living, so it has to be a metaphor for something. By light, it could mean like joy or happiness or positivity, or just something we can emotionally hold on to. The we is interesting, because that's where you bring other people, and unity, and maybe even a little bit of diversity into the mix. That is the meaning of this title. Maybe we're relying on each other by holding this mutual light we carry to get through tough times. What I like to say on this channel, as of now, is that you can judge a well-marketed book by its cover and title. She could have called it Peter the Peanut Butter Panda, but unless it's a metaphor of some kind, I'm sure it would ideally be about a peanut butter panda named Peter. Granted, I've never heard of a peanut butter panda, but if we just keep carrying this light, maybe one will come out of it. I, I don't know where I was going with that. Here, this is the hater's chance to blame how I, how delusional I am on admiring Michelle Obama. On to what the book is about. It says in the description that the former first lady shares practical wisdom and powerful strategies for staying hopeful and balanced in today's uncertain world. She considers the questions many of us struggle with. How do we build enduring and honest relationships? How can we discover strength and community in Inside our differences. What can we do when it feels like too much? Knock, knock. Who's there? Bruh. Bruh who? Brene Brown. Michelle Obama offers listeners a series of fresh stories and insightful reflections on change, challenge, and power, including her belief that when we light up for others, we can illuminate the richness and potential of the world around us, discovering deeper truths and new pathways for progress. Talk about powerful. Drawing from her experiences as a mother, daughter, spouse, friend, and first lady, it's a common thing we see on this channel. For autobiographers to discuss not much more than really just their experiences. They might tell you what happened, but they don't always talk about it and how it ultimately affected them and what they learned from it in the grand scheme of things. It almost sounds like a lot of this book might focus on the things she learned from what she wrote in Becoming. She shares the habits and principles she has developed to successfully adapt to change and overcoming various obstacles. She details her most valuable practices like starting kind, going high, and a assembling a kitchen table of trusted friends and mentors. This reminds me of some strange options I saw when I was doing research for a video and I was reading about full-time Amazon employee benefits like Skillshare and Ramp Back. What is a ramp back? Like those, however, when you actually do research into them, these do sound pretty useful. With trademark humor, candor, and compassion, she also explores issues connected to race, gender, and visibility. This cannot be easy. These are tricky tricky topics. Presuming she does it well, bravo Michelle, encouraging listeners to work through fear, find strength in community, and live with boldness. On to why she would write it. Well, I want to think it's a little apparent why she would bother putting this kind of book together. I'll give you a hint. I think that it rhymes with the schmovid schmandemic of schmunty schmunty. In all seriousness, and that did sound silly, but I was serious, the impact of that on our medical and educational systems, economy, it's pretty evident. Interest rates are already going up again, and I don't need to hear about this from the news. This affects the livelihoods of you, your partner, if you have a partner, your friends. Let's just pretend I have friends in this instance for the sake of argument, okay? Can I do that just once? Your friends, your family, you'll hear about it, okay? Times are hard, and when times are hard, you need someone to connect with and someone to carry a light with. That must be a heavy light. 
<laughs> Damn, if it needs that many people to carry it, right? I may be taking the title too seriously, but when is this book coming out? The Light We Carry by Michelle Obama. This book is expected to come out, the paperback, hardcover and audio versions on November 15th, 2022. It's coming, everybody. Mark your calendars. But that is the light we carry, what we know so far about Michelle Obama's brand new book coming up soon, guys. I am going to review this book when I do. I will drop a link to that review in the description of this video. In the meantime, if you want to pre-order it or afterwards, if you want to take a look at the reviews, uh, I'll drop a link to that as well. That and any other books I mentioned in this video, if you want to check those out too. If there are any other books that you guys want me to check out and review or any other books that are coming, you know, in the next several, several months that you're very excited for, please let me know in the comments below. Also, let me know if you're going to check out this book. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, because I don't get why people watch this far into my videos and they don't subscribe. But if you have subscribed and you want to turn it up just a notch and turn on that notification bell to get a notification whenever I drop new videos, that would mean the world to me. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. You can find me everywhere and I will see you then.